Hello, my name is Miguel Polito. I'm a systems engineer with Dell OEM, and I'm here to demonstrate the Latitude 10. It's a 10.1 inch touchscreen tablet, and I've written a C Sharp application um, to demonstrate some of the deployment um, options you have with this unit and some examples of scenarios. So I've stuffed my C Sharp application into the shell startup folder um, to boot to application in this case. And so we notice there's no um, tiles on the desktop. And when we get to the um, landing page for the application, we see uh, various options to choose from, various buttons. And again, these are um, just to show the various deployment options that we have for our Latitude 10. So if we look at the first option, we look at the um, ticket counter. So this is to simulate um, checking in at the airport. You would touch here. You'd uh, provide your flight number or your confirmation number. You'd enter that in. You'd be greeted with a welcome aboard message and provided your tickets and on your way. The next area is on the venue directory. So we've all gone to conferences. Um, this conference is the System Conference 2020, so I'll be looking forward to that. Um, and so um, what this is to show is an application that would help you find a specific vendor. Um, in our case, we hopefully want to be looking for Dell. And uh, so you have the option of scrolling, obviously, that I just demonstrated, and um, also looking by uh, customer name. So we can go here. Um, we could find Dell and it would send us to the appropriate location. The next uh, demo is that of a medical demo. So again, it's to show uh, the possibilities that uh, this unit could be used in a uh, medical field. And so in this example, I've written the app to be able to show um, CT scanned x-rays or neck and spine x-rays. And so if we look at the CT scan, we could see the uh, brain x-rays being displayed here. Neck and spine. And so another area that we can look at is the media center. And so this could be um, an IFE, an in-flight entertainment, um, or a media center uh, that you'd have in a car uh, to control various options. So um, you could have your safety video, your movies, music, um, shopping, or pictures. So if I wanted to take a look at my favorite movie here. And so what this does is I've, I've made it so that it taps into the default player. So you can... Um, can choose whatever default player you want. Um, in this case, I'm using Windows Media Player because that's the default player in Windows 8. So it launches our video. So we get the idea. We also have an option. Um, so if you're out doing presentations, um, you want to quickly deploy a presentation for a customer site, um, click on your nifty tab to launch your presentation. You can run through the products, providing comparison between the various models, our Weiss, PowerEdge, 1U, 2U, etc. And then finally, um, if you're a gamer, um, you can go ahead and launch your League of Legends. And what that'll do is it'll um, tap into your um, executable for your game. Launch it from there.
and log in as appropriate to play. And finally, uh, the two red um, squares on the right lower hand side are uh, shortcuts for task manager and then uh, to shut down the device. So in our case, um, if we were deploying into a, a certain niche market where we don't want to see the uh, desktop or use any of the desktop, a traditional desktop um, resources, uh, we would want to exit out of the whole system or shut down from the application that we're in. So um, we click on our button there to shut down. And there we see our shutdown screen. And the unit is off. Thanks.